Inferno is on the verge of being removed. Copenhagen Major has started and pro players are avoiding Inferno at all costs. This is due to issues like Banana being too crowded. Valve addressed this in an update on February 28th, where they brought multiple changes to Inferno, like smoothing out the ground movement in Banana in Bombsite A. This seemed great, but it didn't change the opinions of the pro players. For Copenhagen, the entire first day had zero matches on Inferno. Every other map got played, while Inferno was a ghost town. Then comes the second day to the Major, and Inferno was only played once, out of over 29 games so far. This is extremely low, just compared to other maps like Nuker Overpass, which got played 9 and 6 times. Last time I mentioned Inferno being removed as a possibility, it was before the Major, and some thought there was no way Valve would remove Inferno because they recently overhauled it for CS2. But I think they completely forgot about Italy and how that map got overhauled but just sits for casual lobbies. Just because it got overhauled doesn't mean it needs to get played for pro play. Casual matchmaking does not impact the competitive map pool. If it did, the most popular map does too would be in the map pool. But pro players do not like playing it, similar to Inferno, so it got removed. Just one week after the Rio Major where Dust 2 was played two times the entire Major. Which is why it's important to monitor how many times Inferno is being played, as at the moment it's very little, similar to the situation with Dust 2. Which is bad news if you like Inferno, because if Valve sees a map which they think will be getting played more, maybe it's Train, Tuscan, or Cobblestone that they're currently working on, and decide to do a swap in the map pool, well that is very likely to take place. I'm highly expecting Inferno to be removed if it doesn't keep getting drastic changes in updates where Valve is trying to fix the problem. Season 2 of Premiere would be a great time to release the new map. Luckily I made an entire video going over everything for Season 2 that you need to know.